sculpture has kind of a sexual side to it. So you go into a relationship um, which has it up and downs. The outcome is, you know, at the beginning always very uncertain. Um, but I do have learned to realize when the sculpture is strong enough to fight me back and then I let it go and I, had, I have also learned that, you know, when this, this point has arrived, that I let it go. I started them, I think, late 2009, beginning 2010. Um, I started to assemble material, because for this series I actually use uh, a lot of uh, found material, which you know, have some kind of uh, irreplaceable markings and memories from previous use. And, um, I think I did one or two, and then I left them alone, and I started other things in between, and then I went back to it. And uh, so it, it took basically over two years to, to make the, the whole series, and then there was one point where I felt it is strong enough, and uh, I, should, I should let it go. Uh, I, I want them to go out and to have uh, interaction, conversation, uh, dialogues. It takes a lot of bad ideas which have to be eliminated to find the one uh, idea which you think you know, will actually work for you. And then it takes a life on its own. It, it develops itself and very often really it is what you were thinking at the beginning doesn't matter at the end anymore or has transformed itself into something else. Young adulthood, I made some art, but uh, then I got sidetracked and I kept all my relationship to the art world. And as I said, I did some collaborations. The most famous one probably was Jenny Holtz and Louis Bourgeois. And then in 2005, I just said I, I really want to dedicate myself completely in making art. I actually took some time off to just reset my head and everything because you get into a routine and I really wanted to, you know, to, to leave everything behind, so to speak. This is what I originally wanted to do, um, but my parents uh, were thinking that being an artist is not really a job at the time. Yeah, it wasn't allowed to later, so for me it's just coming uh, full circle on one hand and back to what I really wanted to do from the beginning. So it's, it, for, for me it's, uh, it, it was not a hard decision and it is it's the right decision. <laughs>